Arizona school district leaders adopted a data-based model to help them decide when to scale up or scale down school operations during the COVID-19 pandemic. But this action is not the last word on how schools will run. MTN's Jonathan Ambarian reports. At a meeting on Tuesday, the Helena School Board approved going forward with a metrics-based system that will help determine whether to further reopen schools or return to more restricted operations. But Superintendent Tyler Ream says they'll still be refining the model as the year goes on. What the board really approved on Tuesday was a commitment that we would use data, and particularly local data, as an indicator in informing decisions that we need to make, particularly around opening, closing schools, phasing schools, etc. The district has been working on a metrics-based model for a number of weeks, with input from public health leaders. Their primary indicator will be the rate of positive COVID-19 cases in Lewis and Clark County per 100,000 population. If case rates are in a lower range for three consecutive weeks, leaders would consider moving to a less restrictive phase of operations. If they are higher for three weeks, leaders could return to tighter restrictions. For additional context, the district will consider other data, like the rate of positive tests, the trend in active cases, and the number of cases associated with schools. Reem says their original draft model called for phasing down school operations earlier. He says they adjusted it after looking at more guidance from around the country. Ultimately, most people feel more comfortable with something in the middle. While the number of school-associated cases in the district has continued to grow in recent weeks, Reem said leaders still believe their rules on masking and distancing have limited any spread within the schools. We can't stop the virus necessarily from coming into school, but we can stop it from spreading in school by utilizing these health and safety protocols. And as long as our health partners are expressing confidence that that's working, it gives me confidence to stay in this phase one as opposed to the phase zero. Reem said judging by the current COVID-19 data, it's unlikely they'd be ready to propose any change in phases until next month at the earliest. In Helena, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News. 29 COVID-19 cases have been reported among Helena Public Schools students and staff since March. 18 of those were reported in just the last two weeks.